Hey what's up guys. Today we are listing the top 5 3D printers of 2022. Don't forget to like subscribe and hit the notification bell. The Elego Saturn is the counterpart to the smaller Elego Mars series of printers, which offer solid build quality for a reasonable price. The Saturn takes this formula to the extreme by offering a large 7.55x4.72x7.87 inch build volume while simultaneously increasing the resolution of the masking LCD. This, combined with the 2.5 second per layer cure time from the mono LCD, means that the Saturn can print more parts in the same amount of time as the smaller format Mars series of printers. Elego has developed a two bolt bed leveling solution for the Saturn that makes the leveling process a quick and painless process. This, combined with the native integration with the Katubox Slicer app, makes setting up and using the Saturn a simple process that is ideal for both beginners as well as experienced users. The Saturn has a build volume of 280.46 cubic inches, a dramatic increase from the 100.81 cubic inch build volume of the smaller Elego Mars 2 Pro. If you're looking for a resin printer that offers a large build volume but you don't want to compromise with a lower quality print, the Saturn is an ideal solution but you might have to check Amazon several times before you can find one. The Anycubic Viper is designed for high-throughput 3D printing and impressed us with its rock-solid build construction and impressive list of features. Silent stepper drivers, dual-Z threaded rods and a high airflow part cooling system are just a few of the many features that make the Viper an easy choice for anyone interested in printing out large quantities of parts, the strain gauge bed leveling system allows the Viper to quickly and accurately complete an automatic mesh bed calibration. This form of calibration is ideal for anyone who doesn't want to spend a lot of time tweaking or calibrating the printer, and it worked well during testing and didn't require any further adjustments to get an even first layer. The Viper isn't the cheapest printer on this list, but it earned its place by providing a fast setup and trouble-free operation throughout our testing. The Viper was designed with an impressive level of attention to detail, and the various areas on a 3D printer that would require adjustment, extruder, X slash Y belts, etc., are all easily accessible and adjustable. The included Kura Slicer app is easy to use, but the printer profile that ships with the machine might require some tweaking that beginning users may struggle with. It can be hard to find a single 3D printer that does everything well, but the Voxela Berries is an impressive machine that offers high performance printing at a budget price without compromising on build quality. The Ares is designed to be a beginner friendly machine and the semi-automated three-point bed leveling process means you can be up and printing in less than an hour after opening the box. The Ares features a Core XY motion system, which means the build platform remains stationary during printing, and only moves down in the Z direction during layer changes. This means that the printed part is not moved back and forth during printing which makes it easier to print tall, thin parts without worrying about them toppling over. In addition, features like the built-in Wi-Fi allow the Ares to be started remotely, which is ideal for anyone who doesn't like moving files back and forth via microSD card or USB flash drive, selling for a very reasonable $299, currently $279.99 on Amazon. The Voxela Berries is a 3D printer that punches way above its weight class and offers a lot to anyone interested in a plug-and-play 3D printer. The simple, guided setup and easy-to-read LCD screen on the Voxelab makes it ideal for classroom and library use, and the durable plastic enclosure is perfect for young learners. For anyone interested in a more hands-on experience who wants to build the printer themselves, the Creolite Ender 3 Pro is slightly less expensive and offers a more modular system. If you ask someone involved with 3D printing what their first machine was, there's a good chance they'll tell you it was the Creolite Ender 3 Pro. A wildly popular 3D printer, the Ender 3 Pro packs a powerful punch in the form of a low-cost machine that has an almost endless supply of readily available upgrades to adapt it to your specific needs. Whether you want a 3D printer to convert into a laser engraver, a pen plotter, or just a printer to print specialized high-temperature materials, the Ender 3 Pro can accommodate you with no issues. The Ender 3 Pro arrives as a kit in need of assembly, 
so you'll want to put aside at least a few hours to build, calibrate, and possibly troubleshoot your new machine before using it. The Ender 3 Pro has a 350 watt power supply, so the bed and heated nozzle heat up quickly and keep a consistent temperature when printing. Creolite has released all of the mechanical and electrical schematics for this machine under an open source license, so it's easy to find upgrades and modifications that have been built using these blueprints. If you love to tinker and can't wait to turn your 3D printer into a custom build, it's hard to go wrong with the Creolite Ender 3 Pro. Considered the best 3D printer overall by many aficionados, the Prusa MK3S Plus has received countless industry accolades and awards, and with good reason. The MK3S Plus is a powerhouse 3D printer that combines reliable hardware, feature-rich software, and a support channel that makes the Prusa Signature Black and Orange hardware a common sight in 3D printing farms. The MK3S Plus is based on the i3 platform and has benefited from several generations of incremental upgrades which have resulted in one of the best 3D printers on the market, silent stepper drivers, removable textured build platforms, automatic bed leveling probe and more, the list of features that come stock on the Prusa MK3S Plus is certainly impressive. But that's only part of the story with the MK3S Plus. Prusa has developed their own slicer app, Prusa Slicer, for processing 3D models and is actively adding new features requested by the community. Features like the ability to paint on support material, create variable layer heights and generate custom printer profiles are examples of how Prusa Slicer enables the MK3S Plus to leap ahead of the competition, at a price point of $999 for an assembled printer and $749 for a DIY kit. The MK3S Plus is one of the most expensive machines on this list. That price may raise some eyebrows among 3D printing enthusiasts who have become accustomed to printers in the sub-$300 price range, but for power users who need uncompromising performance and industry-leading documentation and support. The MK3S Plus is at the top of the list.